Hi guys, um, so this is my first ever YouTube video, well hopefully if it actually uploads, um, and this is going to be a Disney, mostly a Disney store haul, and a bit of Primark and Model Zone. So the other day I went to Westfield with my mates, and you went into the Disney store there, and I'll show you what I got from there, and where, what I got from Primark, which is Disney related to, and my Model Zone, which is a couple of nail varnishes, so... I'm going to start off with the Disney store, but which the stuff I bought from Watford, which was about I think a week ago now. So that's what I'm going to show you first. So I'm going to start off with this bag. So, firstly, I mean, I like Rapunzel, but she's not my favourite. Because um, Belle from Beauty and the Beasties. But I saw this and I thought, right i got to get this because I can. I don't have to use it for what it's meant to be used for. So this is classed as a pencil case and it's got Rapunzel on it. And it's got little Pascal. I think this is adorable. I think that's one of the main reasons I bought it because he's so cute. But anyway, so inside, I'll show you what I mean by I don't want to use it as a pencil case. It's just like one main compartment and that's it. Well, there are two, but it looks like one joint one. So I was going to use it for like makeup, makeup brushes, or even say going to if I go to Disneyland Paris or something like that, I would use it as like a night, like a purse. Like when if I go out at the night, just go into the restaurant or something, I'd use it to put a bit of money and my phone in because I think it's Disney in it, so it's not it's going to like fit in. But I think it'd be really good to use it as that because I'm not going to use it as a pencil case. But this was. I think it was around seven pounds. I don't know because the little, the little tag's been picked. Them not the tag. The um, sticker's been pulled off, but it's not going to focus because it's okay. But it's just got the euros on it, and the euros were nine, nine euros and ninety cent. But I, do, I think it was around seven pounds. So I thought it was quite good for this, and it's all glittery as well. I don't think you can. Oh, you can. You sort of see that there. But yeah, it's really cute. So that'd be really useful. Now the next thing I bought, and this was at the till, because you know they, so they're like, oh we've got this special deal, if you buy this, then this is going to be cheaper than what it actually is. And I like Spider-Man, so this is what I bought. And it's like a hard, it's quite hard, so it's like, protects anything that's inside. And it's actually like, cur well not curved, but it's to what, so his little nose is sticking out, and his forehead's a bit like that. So anyway, this, I think, I don't know, it's not, you can choose it as a pencil case, but it's a bit big, but inside are all Spider-Man themes, so you've got felt tips here in a little netting pocket. This is a notepad, or just a clear one, and then you've got scissors, um, sharpener, rubber, stencils, pen, glue, um, normal pencils and colouring pencils. Now I quite like art, so I'm definitely going to use all these because I needed some new colouring pencils actually. But I think afterwards, probably may use it for makeup again, just to so when going holiday, it's good to use it. And any or even, okay, just to put like a might fit an iPad Mini actually, just to put it in. So and it's going to protect it whatever's in there, so it should be good. But and it's got on the little, it's got a little keyring which should be taken off and you can use it for something else. That's got a little spider on it for the logo of Spider Man. And originally, this was £12.95, but I think I got it for about £7 because of how much I spent in the store. And it was like the special deal behind the till. So, yeah, I'm going to definitely be using that. And I can't wait to use all the new pencils. They look really good. So, that was the second thing I bought. Now, the third thing, right, this is actually my mum's. But I'm going to show you what my mum bought as well and what my brother, little brother bought just so you can see what's in the shop but she bought this Simpson bag now it's cute very cute because it's got all the characters on it well not all of them but most of them so you've got a compartment here at the front of the bag the plain I think yeah it's the normal compartment and then in the second it is just normal again I believe yeah so that's just normal it's quite big so you can fit like you know a small bottle of water your phone anything in here 
It's also got an adjustable strap too, so you can even have it across the body. Oh, you can even have it across the body or anything like that, which I mean I quite like across the body, but we'll see what my mum use it for. And then also, look how cute this is. It's a little stitch purse. And it's adorable. And the little ears are like 3D. He's got little feet. He's like the act like the zoom zoom. So this can come off as well, obviously. He's got a little touch thing. And he's just a little little purse for little coins or well, I think it's coins. I don't think I don't know what else you could fit in there. If you can find use for it, then go ahead. So this was £14.95. Which it's alright, I suppose. But so you got all your basic characters, Tigger, Daisy, Donald, Mickey, um, Dumbo, oh I forgot then. <laughs> uh, Stitch, my missing Goofy up here, Winnie the Pooh. I think Minnie, oh yeah, I think Minnie. Is she on the back? Yeah, she's on the back here. Minnie there. We also got Dale for the red nose. And Chip for the black nose. So yeah. It's got your original characters on there, which is really cute. And I just think they're, it's really, it's quite plain, but you've got like their certain, so like Goofy's hat is coloured and and Daisy's bow is coloured, so you just got the key parts of the characters coloured, which is is simple but effective. I think, and then, oh, and then I saw this and I was like, I have to have it. I just, it's so cute. It's gonna sit on my, it's, it will sit on my bed and it look really cute. And I was like, I don't care what the price is. I don't care. And it's a Sven cushion, and he is adorable. He's so soft. And he's got these ears that stick out and the little tuft of hair which is so fluffy and his little antlers stick out and they're like a silky feeling. And his little buck teeth and he's just so cute and fluffy and I just thought I want him. So anyway I looked at the price, looked at the tag and originally he was £16.95 but then I saw this little sticker and he was reduced to £10 and I was like right. This is mine, I need to own it, so I got him. And he's just so adorable, he sits in my bed every night. I just think it was something I had to have, because like, who doesn't like Frozen? Like, I like Frozen, I know all the words and songs, just because. It's like, it's not the bestest Disney film ever, it's just the most, I think it's the most catchy Disney film ever. And, well, I had to have him, he's too cute. <laughs> right, now I think I'll do what my brother bought which were, he started to collect these, I don't know if you know them, it's a brand called Pop, and they create, Dis so it's not Disney, Disney don't make them, they do Disney characters, and he's just started to collect them, I don't, I'm not that into them, but I mean he is, so I'll just let him do what he wants, but they're these little characters, and they do Disney, so this is Joy, from Inside Out, and she was £9.95, and they do the all these little boxes, a little pop here, and they do all of these from inside out. My brother has sadness and anger as well, but he bought them ages ago. But he's just started to collect them. I mean, I'm not. I do. I like animations, and I do collect some of them, and I have a couple sets because I think they're 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 smaller than these are. I, I mean, she's alright. She's got a little dress, her blue hair, but her feet are really small, so she doesn't stand up that well. But I mean. I think he's going to collect the whole set because he just likes them so I'll just let him get on with it so that was that one and then he bought um, Arlo from the Good Dinosaur and I think he's the cutest I do think out of the all he's cute, he's got little spots on his little nose and he's got like little, they're not bumps they're just painted on and his little feet are so adorable now he was seven pound forty six, which he was reduced. And it was sticking there. Um, I don't know why, because I mean the next one is from the Good Dinosaur, and he's reduced as well. The Good Dinosaur doesn't seem to be that pop. Well, in some shops you've got like a whole wall of the Good Dinosaur, and it's all that. But I mean, I don't think people are getting into it as much, because I think Zootopia from completely like taking it over. I can like Zootopia. But um, I feel like the good dinosaur is cute, like especially when this little dude, okay, this little guy, 
and he's introduced and he talks about his parents. That is the most upsetting thing. Well, not the most upsetting thing I've seen in a Disney film, but one of. Because he... If you haven't seen it, spoiler alert, okay. He, you meet him and then he, during the film, he has... If you don't want to know this, if you haven't watched Good Dinosaur and you're planning to, do not listen to the next minute or two minutes. So anyway... Um, he gets these two, he gets three sticks, one little one and two big ones, um, representing his two parents. And um, Arlo did it and he knocked down his dad because his dad was dead and buried it to explain to the to Spot that he was dead. And so Spot did it as well and he knocked down both of his parents and buried them and like covered them up. And me and my brother just started crying. It was so... It was just like, why? Why are both his parents dead? Seems to be a thing with Disney movies. Disney films, like, there's hardly any princesses that have both their parents alive. But anyway, so this was reduced to 7.46. And obviously, originally it's 9.95 because they're all well, normally 9.95. But, um, yeah, so that was him. And that's both, that's the only two you can get in the Good Dinosaur set is Spot and Arlo. And then I went to, so when I went to Westfield, I think I'm going to start moving, I think this is Westfield, yeah, this is all Westfield now. Um, when I went to Westfield, he wanted me to get him um, a pop, because he was like, right, I, want, I really want one. I want, we just we had just watched Zootropolis, and he really wanted the sloth, because he just thinks he's hilarious. He's quite funny, I mean, that part was hilarious. So I got him Flash from Zootopolis or Zootopia, whatever you want to call it. And he's he's cute. He's got a little tie, a little shirt. He's quite cute. So that's the one he wanted, and he really likes him. And he was nine ninety five, so the original price. He wasn't reduced. But yeah, he was. So yeah, that's the box he comes in. So he comes. You come in with a little character next whatever one you're buying the characters on the box but um he really liked that so i was like fine give us the money i'll get it for you but my friends are not they're not obsessed with disney so they were like i walked in this disney shop and i was like oh my god it's disney these songs were coming on i'm singing along because you know i just wanted to be a five-year-old for like you know what 20 minutes and they were like can you hurry up this is so boring but i was like no let me embrace my disneyness please <laughs> but um they were fine with it, it's all good. Right, so anyway, Disney. So I bought what I for myself. Now, I know I said I'm not obsessed with like, Rapunzel, like she's one of my favourite, but she's not my favourite. Um, so anyway, Disney have brought out this new collection, and it's a princess collection of mugs. And um, so I saw this um, in the Watford. Disney store and I was like right I have two mini mugs two Disney mini mugs I'm not gonna get it that's it final so I didn't get it went to Westfield saw him again I was like oh, I gotta get it now like I've seen it for the second time and it is really pretty once you properly look at it close it's really pretty I think Disney mugs are just something everyone has to have so anyway it's this Rapunzel mug and it's got Rapunzel on here and it says believe in your dream that's the wrong way around no nope. Because believe in your dreams on here. And then on the other side it's got Rapunzel again. And little butterflies. And then on here it's got a little Pascal. I oh, can't see that, can you? Little Pascal. There's an R for Rapunzel. And I think there's oh there we go. Lanterns for the song. Um I see the light, which I always cry at. That is just just gets to me because it, it comes up if you've been to Disneyland Paris and you've watched Dreams it comes up on the castle and it brings up all these lanterns and it just as soon as that first note starts from that song I'd start crying that last time we went my parents were like yeah that's nice and they turned around to me and I was just like because <laughs> it was so upset and now every time it comes on the telly that's it I'm gone I don't know why it's just like I think my friend cried it as well and she doesn't like Disney and I was just like I just hugged her I was like it's okay it's fine but yeah, I really like this, and I know the collection, I think there's four of them, and it's Rapunzel, Belle, Snow White, and Cinderella, so I'll definitely be getting the Belle one next time, and I mean, I don't, I think then hopefully they'll bring out more, because um, I'd love to see Aurora as one, 
But um, there was also, if you go on my Instagram and Twitter, I posted a picture. I'll put the link down. I put um, the link to the accounts in the comments down below. Um, and I put a picture of all the mugs. And next to these four was a frozen one and the two sisters of from Frozen. So there was two mugs of Frozen. I don't know if they were including the set or not because I didn't properly look at them like properly. But um, next time I go to a Disney store. I'll check them out and I'll let you know if they're part of the set. But um, yeah, I think she was really cute. And she's also, she looks a bit older. So it looks like it's more for teens and not like really babyish for like little kids. So I just had to have her. I think Disney mugs are a thing. Like if you are into Disney, you're going to, you definitely will have a Disney mug. There is no way you do not have a Disney mug because they are, they're just a, like the Disney thing. You must, you have to get them like. I don't know what it is with them. I don't know what it is, but um, they're just so detailed and so nice that they're so pretty. And you just have to have them, basically, because my family must have. I don't know. We have loads and loads of Disney mugs. Like I can't stop buying them. Like I know I don't need them. I'll probably just use that mug once and that'll be it. But it's just a thing I have to have. But anyway, I'll get on. <laughs> I'll stop talking. So I saw this, I needed a purse, a bigger one than I already had, because I had this River Island one that was about just really small, but I needed a purse, a bigger one, um, and I saw this in the Disney store, and I was like, right, well I needed one, so I've got to get it, and it's so adorable, and it's this little, it's this mini purse, and it's gold, so this, this cup bit's gold, and you got her Diamante bow on here, and I haven't taken the seal off yet, but I'm going to leave it on for a bit, and on the back, it's there's a zip and that and in and inside you got your little compartment little zip that opens up and your picture frame and card slots. Now this was seven ninety five, which I thought was not bad because you go to places like River Island and they're like eighteen pound for a purse. And I was like, that's a bit you know expensive. I was like, I got to get this because it's just so cute and it's gonna fit in any bag I take. Cause I don't have a smaller bag than this. And that's just going to fit in my bag. I'll definitely be using this on my next Disney trip. Whenever that will be. And so, yeah. It's just so cute. And I just had to get So, I needed it anyway. Um, I just remembered, I don't think I gave you the price for that mug. Um, that mug, I think, was... Just check. That mug was... This mug was 7 95 which I think all of them are. Most mugs are like that. But yeah, I think all of the set is 7 95 um, so I think, oh, and then, so my mum asked me to get a top for my brother that wasn't in his size at the Watford store, so she was like, right, we'll go and have a look at Westfield, see if you can get it in his size, but it wasn't in his size, so I thought, right, I'll get him a t-shirt anyway, and obviously, like I said before, we just watched, we just watched Zootropolis and he really liked it, so I got him this Nick Wilde top, and it says, the fox has arrived, and I thought it was really cute, because especially the colour, like, it goes with jeans or shorts or whatever, but my brother, he really liked it, so I'm happy with that. But it's just a picture of Nick World being himself with that slogan on it. And I just thought it was really cute. Now this was seven ninety five. Most of seven ninety five. But um yeah, it just suited him. It looked really cute on him as well. But yeah, I just thought that was just something to get him. Because otherwise if I didn't get him something, it'd be like he'd be a bit left out. So I thought Right, well, I'll get him that in. So that was that. And then, right. Oh, I'll go back to what I got at the Watford store. So, I'm a Zoom Zoom collector. I just love them. They're so adorable and cute. Now, I wasn't going to get this. I wasn't going to get this set, which was the Star Wars, the new Star Wars set. Because, I mean, I like Disney. Don't get me wrong. I like all Disney films. It's just Star Wars just doesn't... It was, I just don't get it. I don't like the space stuff. I mean, I've never even watched one the whole way through. It just, I just bores me. So anyway, I got. I don't even know who they are because they're really cute, and I just had to get them. I saw them, and the details on them are so cute. So if anyone knows who they are, please comment below. But this is someone from Star Wars, and I just saw this little moustache, and look at him. The details on them are so cute. And then I saw this lightsaber, and I was like, right, I'm getting them. I knew I said I wasn't going to get them, but I just got two not bad and then the other one where have we got there he is his hair look at the hair it's just so mm. and 
then he's got a blue lightsaber as well. So he's cute. I don't know what this is on his ear. I don't know. But um, the usual price, as always, these are the mini Zoom Zooms are £3. So I just had to get them. I think it's the problems of being a Zoom Zoom collector. And then I saw this. I thought, right, I could put anything in there. I haven't really chosen what to put in here yet. But it's a screw. It's got Mickey head and it screws. And I just thought it's really, really cute. And I mean, I could use it for anything in my jewellery. Anything really. So this was £4.95. And it's just really adorable. And I mean, I haven't chosen what to do. Like, it, like use. I haven't chosen what to use it for yet. So jewellery. Hairbands. Hair clips. That'd be good. Oh yeah, bobby pins. I might use for bobby pins. I'm always losing them. It's just a girl problem. And then, as always, you get to the end. You get to the till. And they have these range of bags. And they're like, right, do you want to, for a pound, instead of having a 5p bag, do you want to get one of these? And I was like, right, go on then. I've already got an Elsa one. And it was this mini one. And I mean, you could use this. Hmm, I don't know. You can go swimming. You could use it for that. Or, I don't really know, going around someone's house, you dump all your clothes in. But it's really cute. It's got mini both sides. Same design on both sides with bows. And it's also got a zip, and I don't really like bags without zips. Because I think anyone can probably get into them. So a zip really secures it, it makes me feel better. So yeah, so I think that was like just an extra pound at the checkout. So that was good. And then, I think that's it. Oh no, one more thing. So my mum actually gave me a shopping list to go to the store with. And on that shopping list was one of these. The Zootropolis pen that records Nick Wilde and records Judy Hopps. And so Judy uses this. Just watch the film. Watch the film. I won't do any more spoilers like I did before. Um, and so you'll see it in the film. And it actually records and plays back. And it also goes through some of her phrases. It's not a hassle, sweetheart. Yeah. Stop in the name of the law! Nicholas Wilde, you are under arrest. <laughs> Anyone can be anything. Divided, we were animals. Together, we are Zootopia. Zootopia? Always see drop this. It's different names in like every country. Officer Judy Hobbs reporting for duty. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Officer Hobbs, I am in pursuit. Bunnies from the borough do not get stepped on. I'm Officer Hobbs, CPD. Toot toot. Let's show them what a bunny from the borough's kids call a hassle, sweetheart. Hmm, I think that's it. So I think there's about 10 phrases. But then I didn't realize it's actually a pen. It's actually a proper pen. Which I didn't realise, you press the top, and I just, it's really cute, and there's a little thing you can hook it on with. So my mum wanted that, it's also got ZPD, I think this was uh, 7 or £8, pound. it's not bad, it came in like a box and everything, but she had to open it, she needed to look at it, and so because then she was like, oh my god, it's a pen, and I was like, well, what, really? So yeah, that was it, so I think that is all of Disney store. Not all Disney related because I've got more. <laughs> so I went to Primark and I didn't really shop at Primark. So this was like, not a first time, but a proper look around. And I've seen Disney stuff on Instagram. So um, I follow this account that just shows up what Disney stuff is out. And I've seen like loads of stuff from Primark. So anyway, I saw this. There was like a collection of stuff. And there was like a mini backpack, mini shoes and everything like that. And I saw this top. <laughs> And I just thought, this is so adorable. I'll just move the price tag. So adorable. So it's got a printed Mickey and Minnie. And they're not cut off or anything. They go straight through like that. Just around the pocket. And it just says Minnie and Mi Mi Mickey and Minnie XOXO. And I thought, that's going to be so cute. A little pair of shorts something in the summer. Now, then I looked at the price tag. And it's six. It was only six pounds. And I was like, what? Really? So I just had to have it. And I know Primark's it's not that expensive. It's quite cheap. So I thought, right, well that's mine. I'm gonna have that. So that was what I, that was the thing I bought from Primark, and I'll probably be going back in there because they had this mini backpack which was really cute, and I might get that next time. So the last thing I bought was from Model Zone. Now I use their nail varnishes and eyeshadow and lipstick and stuff like that. And so they had this deal, and it was um, six nail varnishes for twenty pounds. So I went with three friends, so there's four of us, but one of my friends didn't want it. So Louisa didn't get anything. Then me, R my friend Rebecca, and my friend Ruth split it. So 
I got two nail varnishes and both of them got two nail varnishes each so then we split the cost afterwards so it's about six pound six pound each of us so we can get to new nail varnishes now on their own this they're five pound already so it's quite it's a good deal so anyway i got this rose gold one which at the moment is like their top seller so i'll just do this for you so you can see it now i wanted to get this one because it'll go with my phone and it also go with a new bag i just bought because the zips are this color and it's a metal effects one which i really like because it just makes it more shinier. So anyway, this is the rose gold. I don't have to more gold than anything. And then I bought this blue one. Because blue is my favourite colour. And it's like a metal. And obviously, like I said, metal effect. It's really shiny. And that. Oh, I'm just trying. This is really badly painting. I'm sorry. I'll just try and do it quick just so I can show you what it looks like. This is the blue one. And I just thought, I'll get these both. So those are the two nail And then you also got a free, um, nail, var nail varnish. Nail file, buffer, and stuff like that. Because just because you went in the shop. So anyway, that was, I think that's all. That's all I bought. Um, please give me your feedback in the comments. Because I really want to know, like, how I did. Because I just want to know if I did good. Because this is my first one. So I want to know if I should carry it on or anything. Um, so yeah, uh, feel free to like and subscribe, um, and I'll be back hopefully soon with a next haul or vlog or something like that. I might put my Westfield vlog up if I can get that going. But yeah, thanks for watching.